must be wiser than the king. The end is near. I told you before, I'm not interested in this nonsense. And I've wasted my time here. You can show yourself now, Jaina. He's gone. I'm sorry for eavesdropping, Master, but... <laughs> it's your inquisitive nature that I've come to rely on, child. That crazed fool's convinced that the world is about to end. I've heard the rumors of the plague spreading throughout the Northlands. Do you truly believe that the plague is magical in nature? It's a strong possibility. That's why I need you to travel there and investigate the matter. I've arranged for a special envoy to assist you. Yes, Master. I'll do my best. I know you will, child. Farewell. Wizards of the Kirin Tor, I am Arthas, first of the Lich King's Death Knights. I demand that you open your gates and surrender to the might of the Scourge. Greetings, Prince Arthas. How fares your noble father? Lord Antonidas, there's no need to be snide. We've prepared for your coming, Arthas. My brethren and I have erected auras that will destroy any undead that pass through them. Your petty magics will not stop me, Antonidas. Pull your troops back, or we will be forced to unleash our full powers against you. Make your choice, Death Knight. I sense that three separate wizards are maintaining these auras. If you find and kill them, the auras will disperse. No way. It pains me to even look at you, Arthas. I'll be happy to end your torment, old man. I told you that your magics could not stop me. The spellbook is all yours, Lich. Let's take it and leave before the wizards amass for their final attack. Indeed. I will begin summoning Lord Archimond at sunset. I sense powerful spirits stirring nearby. Arthas murdered a number of Archmagi when the Scourge ravaged this land. Now the wizard's invisible spirits can find no rest. Perhaps we should track them down and give them peace. I sense something elusive. Outstanding. 